So it doesn't matter in the in the in the middle layer or in the back end or form 10 layer where the application, even though you can monitor all the, the hardware levels. So and then how can you uh, this is a really short overview you can so you can pull the the Prometheus the docker container and run docker container so you see that the Prometheus pull the docker container from the github docker hub and you can run simply run the at the docker uh, run docker and then this is the port default port number 9090 and then you have passed the uh, your uh, Prometheus and uh, Prometheus the YAML files like your prom.yml file. This is the definition where your, your your microservices is deployed, where your application is deployed, and then you can which which port, which IP addresses, which computer, and then and and then how the the name of the the the, the applications and then Prometheus come to the play and take this read this EML file and build a, and 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 run the you you docker container and then you can see the all the matrix information but i will show you every step just follow theoretically at the moment but i will show you each each of the step how it is works don't worry it, it, it is really really easy to do so in the docker in Gafana is really very simple that you can pull the Gafana from the you can pull the Gafana from the Docker uh, Docker Hub and then you run the just like Gafana and then pass the Gafana and it, it works. So it's come the Gafana dashboard and then from the in the Gafana dashboard you can configure the the where you Prometheus uh, Prometheus matrix says and load the Prometheus matrix and visualize with the Gafana. That's the that's I I said. So that means exactly what I, I mean here I mean uh, this is our this is our uh, the graph so you have you have applications and this is the applications is composed or, or is, a, is, a, is a published as a standalone jar doesn't matter or is a, is a, is a docker con, docker image and put this docker image in docker container and the load the, the Prometheus um, uh, Docker, Docker image and run the Prometheus and, and configure the pom.eml file to connect with your respective applications. And then Prometheus will publish, expose the, the time series data matrices or databases into the Gafana and you can visualize from here or here, doesn't matter where you can visualize it. That's that's the idea. So we got that. What we discuss, uh, we will finalize. Now it, we have Java Spring Boot based application. Doesn't matter. It is a GUI application or web application or the microservices applications. And then uh, you have uh, you integrate the Spring Boot actuator and then actuator actuator with the, uh, like the micrometer. And then you expose the all the the endpoints. And that I show already show you endpoints for the matrix, the health information, and so on and so forth. There is a hundreds of the endpoint definitions, uh, in the in the in the even though in the JVM level, in the web container levels, and even though that it is possible to monitor your hardware level, and then uh, and then you 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 implement your application, deploy the your application as a Docker or the standalone jar, that depending which which technology you try to do, and then integrate those application into the Prometheus, and uh, Prometheus uh, 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 expose the the matrix information or your data time series database uh, database into the in the Gafana the Gafana Gafana system and you can really visualize the informations of all step of your development applications from 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 back end to the middle and then front end and then other side into into the your complete infrastructure. And infrastructure mean your hardware's and where the machines located, even though in fact including your, your if you are in the cloud platform, co complete cloud systems you can monitor where it is the performance or it is some in caching or your requests and response time, rendering time, all things you can monitor graphically. That's that's the really important nowadays when you make a such a microservice based applications, you need to be monitor uh, 24 7. 24 by 7 uh, every minute every second you need to be monitor those system otherwise you cannot uh, you can compute those complex applications you cannot compute the current uh, competitional markets you need to be do the application to monitor properly and see every step and you need to be visualize it and you need to be really really quickly response your clients okay here is a bug 
here you need to fix here and then you can switch on switch off and the, all the cluster machines and and then so on so forth so now i would really like to thanks uh, all of them uh, and then and subscribe the channels write down your comments your ideas and we will try our best to give it to you uh, from from what are we we learn it you know, and what we get it from our experience and you can also share uh, your experience and make a really really product uh, productive idea or make a really good community to use those things and then share each other and play and then you can and then you can i can i believe it's it's help each of them for our side and your side and other other guys can 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 get it from help can get his support from here the subscribe the channel write down comments and i will continue we will continue uh, the the further screencast for the complete pictures from the from the application requirement step to the development testings with the postman's or soap ui and then deploy the application with docker container and then put the and then and, and configure this docker container uh, co make a docker compose files with the, all the tools or do, with the docker images and then integrate these those one in the prometheus and get the prometheus time series matrix in the grafana you can visualize all the steps that's why so now i say and say bye bye goodbye see you later bye bye